In the garden, plants need water, light and warmth if they are to go strong and healthy. Water is continuously circulating between the land and the sky and this journey is called the water cycle. The sun heats the water in the Earth's oceans, rivers and lakes. As the water heats up, it evaporates as vapour into the air. The water vapour is carried up into the atmosphere where it condenses into clouds. As more and more water vapour condenses, the clouds get heavier. Eventually the vapour becomes water again and falls back to the Earth in the form of rain, hail, sleet or snow. This is called precipitation. When water falls back to the Earth as rain, it falls back into the oceans, rivers or lakes and the water cycle begins again. It's important to conserve water and only use as much water as we actually need. St. Michael's School has a rainwater collection system that collects water. The pupils use this water to water their vegetable beds. You can measure the amount of water that falls in your school by making a rain gauge for the garden.